Welcome back to the channel of Tame Donut884. Today I'm going to show you how to kite boomer in a standard Xbox LFG way. You want to have the build 3P Striker for increased turret handling and weapon aim reload. The increased rate of fire will reduce the time it takes to kill boomer's backpack and it will squeeze out as many bullets as you can to his head. Your main weapon is the Regulus, which is why we use the DNH backpack to make the highest possible damage out of the charged pistol. All gear pieces attributes are rolled to headshot damage and create chance where possible. Uh, we use Super 90 because of its quick delivery of damage and good RPM and one of the best shotguns in the game to use. And one is TQB with the same reason but initially used when you are on the turret or far away from Boomer. The first thing that you want to make sure is that you want to have the healer which in this case is Scott 644 to be shooting the nodes on the 41 turret. This will ensure that he gets the special ammo for doing George at Razorback so he doesn't need to wipe for it and then so that I can be placed on the door where Boomer just spawns to ensure that I get the highest chance of getting the eye. I make myself a space so that the negotiator can proc their damage and I bring Boomer in front of Burger and breaks his chest piece. It is important to not break the chest piece any sooner because uh, breaking the chest piece right at the moment that it is now will buy time for the kata to shoot Boomer's backpack and it will do the stagger animation from Boomer. When he gets down, waste all of your super 90 on the head. And in this clip, I use an Achilles pulse to finish Boomer face quickly. I run to 41 turret. On the bottom right clip, Dotto and Fnatic both break the chest piece at the middle and I shoot the top left backpack of Boomer. Double down again, I shoot the backpack. And then right after I shoot it, I go straight to 45. On your way to the 45 turret, you want to make sure that the kiter that breaks the chest piece on the 41 lane stays close to Boomer while he's transitioning. This is important so that you don't get the eye when you're switching the 41 to 45. And in the case that you do, you want to make sure to communicate with your partner who wants to keep the eye. Either way, you want to bring Boomer to the middle where the black circle is. Here's the clip showing you that the eye will switch if you stay far away. So here's me going to the 41 turret to do the second phase of Boomer. Dotto breaks the chest piece in the middle. I shoot Boomer's top left backpack. I took my regular shot and go back to the turret to do the second level down. I put damage to Boomer. And if you pay attention closely, you can see Dotto Oh, is already trying to run away from Boomer and he creates a lot of space between him and Boomer when me and Dotto meets Boomer's eyes switch to me so you gotta maintain a close range of to Boomer if you are not on the 41 turret I brace Boomer chest piece take an Achilles shot and an end the face all in the middle Here is the viewpoint of the 45 kiter. You want to shoot down the farthest node first and then the closest one because the farthest node both contain two spawn points while the closest one contain one to nothing. Initially you want to hold the ads using a riot foam so that when both nodes are completely down you can call kill and boomer will spawn immediately. Shoot top left of Boomer's backpack. Go back to the terror immediately and do double downs. After you do the 45 turret, you want to kite Boomer to the 41 lane, either through the middle or through the other part of the computers. You want to break Boomer's chest piece in the black circle on the 41 lane 
And then of course, do all headshots. I took an Achilles Pulse again on the second double down. And then go back to the 45 lane. This time, I want to make sure that I keep a close eye on Boomer. And then I bring Boomer to the center. Breaking Boomer chest piece there. Go straight up to him to buy time for the kiter on the turret. And then finish the phase with a regular shot. So here I'm going to show you how to buy time for the kiters to shoot Boomer's backpack by keeping him still. You want to bring Boomer to the middle, break his chest piece. After you do so, you want to go straight up to him, activate his pulse, and then roll back. And then go back straight up to him, activate his pulse again, and then roll back, and then go back straight up to him. You can do this an infinite amount of times. Of course, you want to have a healer in case you do take damage. And that should be more than enough time for the kiters to do damage on Boomer's backpack. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, comment for any questions, and thank you for all of the members and raiders of Division 2 that has been participating in this video. Have fun guys.